Okay, so we're at the desk of Lady Ada because it's part of our work desk. Yeah, edition. that we're gonna you know, here manufacturing. And hey, stuff. we're doing this thing. Yeah. Okay. So you're at the uh, create.arduino.cc site. Yep. And uh, there's a new amazing feature board and more with the Arduino web editor. What is it? Okay. So yeah, the Arduino web editor called Create is a fully online system for basically using the Arduino IDE but without any software install. You just run it through a web browser. You have to install a little bit of a plugin, but it's really easy. Just plug uh, installs onto your web browser, and I've already done that. Um, and I have that running down here. Um, nah, I'm gonna pause on that. And here's what is really neat. So here you can select what boards, and this shows you what boards are available. So everything from the Yun to the lily pad to little bits to the robot and that's ooh, new check this out that's new that's new that's never been there before that was not there before oh yeah so um what we're gonna do is yeah, the uh, circuit playground this is a circuit playground this okay. is developer edition right. so here's what's gonna happen i hope this works live demo so you plug this in yeah and what happens next oh it recognized it see oh yeah which is really nice it automatically detects and it even loads up um, this blink sketch. So let's just try uploading the simple blink sketch. Okay. Um, so again, it's been detected. Yeah. Which is kind of nice. Also, I was like, oh, there's some ESP boards, but it says, okay, I found this board. Yep. Click upload. And what's neat is that the compilation happens on the Arduino servers using Amazon Web Services. Yeah. And then it's oh, going look. to upload. Uploading. And then that's blink. Okay, so let's just do a really quick check. Let's just change this from delaying one second to delaying one tenth of a second so the LED this will blink much much faster so let's try that okay okay click upload okay busy it's doing stuff it's, doing it's going stuff. through this cable right this. yeah <laughs> which is really neat I mean it's like you'll be able to okay. run this on any computer okay so it's uploading yeah yeah and then blinking a lot faster okay, okay. and so that's not we're not done yet okay. you were like oh we're done we're not done check this out the libraries, all the libraries that we've written, all like 250, are available through the library manager in the web browser as well. So NeoPixel sensors, um, like LED drivers, all of that stuff, um, that's all available as well. So for example, I've already said, hey, you know, my favorite is the Adafruit Circuit Playground library, and it pulls in all the examples for you too. So for example, maybe let's upload the Combadge demo. I started playing uh, Super Mario Run yesterday, so let's try uploading that Mario coin. We'll see how this goes. So now that's loaded up, we'll see if this works. Give it a second. Give it a second. Okay, programming, bootloading. Okay. So there you go. Got that point sound coming wow. out of it. you can transport it to a magical world of Koopas. Yeah. <laughs> so, tested it out. So, it's live right now. You don't even have to download any special hourly build. Yeah. Um, if you'd like to try your Circuit Playground instantly without any ID install or whatever board manager, check out create.arduino.cc, sign up, and it's free software available to any user of Circuit Playground. Yeah. But I'm just going to run over to where the circuit playgrounds are made and then I'm going to turn this off.